What's going on you guys? Faze Rainbow here. Yeah, King William. And today, oh, uh, to welcome to today's vlog. Um, hope you guys are having a fantastic weekend because we are. Today we're going fishing. We're just for the evening, we stay out here on the weekend, but it's not this weekend because we got other plans to do also. So today, just like a get together at the campsite because you will see later on in the video. Yeah, as you'll see later on in the vlog, we're going to have some music and all that kind of stuff. As you can see, you guys are probably wondering why we're bringing all these hunks of metal in our arms, the big long pieces of metal. Those are for the fire pit. Um, so we can lay like, uh, what, what will happen is we'll lay the pipes down and put like a grid thing on. And that's what we're going to uh, put our pan on. But other than that, I'll see you guys when we get across the lake. As you can see, that's the lake we're going across. Show them the campsite as well, like go down there. Yeah, I'll show there. you the campsite. There's all of our stuff. Let's yeah, get down the hill here. This is a beautiful lake. Also, also. Yeah, the hill is very steep. Fucking throw the metal bar down. Right about, if, I don't know if you can see in camera. That hard, you can see her actually in the bottom of the lake. Right here. Right about at the tip of the sticker where I'm pointing is where we're going. You can't really see well on camera, but if I had a viewfinder, I would view in for you guys. But other than that, it's not really a spot there, but I'll see you guys when we get across the lake. Anything to add, Liam? Oh, and stay tuned for our live streams tonight. See you guys just across the lake. What's going on, you guys? Phase Rainbow here. Um, before I get into any of the logs today, it, as you can see, I'm having a fire. I'm at a campsite today. Well, in the middle of fucking nowhere. The only way you could get here is by boat. Um, with that being said, um, I'd like to address one thing before we get into any of the parts of the vlogs today is that I'm now live streaming on the Dill Lavera channels. So I will not be live streaming anymore on Face Rainbow. So if you want to see any of my live streams, please go to Dylan Laver. In order to find my channel, the best way to find my channel is to go to Dylan, Dylan Laver intro. Or type in... Or the, another way I actually just realized that uh, the, the best way to find my Dylan Laver gaming channel is type in Dylan Laver 2007 Badger. And then you'll find my channel. Um, so I only had six videos on there at the time because, like I said, back when I first started YouTube, I helped out a buddy of mine, and let's just say I got copyrighted, and it took me almost a year, about a year, to fix it. Other than that, um, Yo, what's going on, guys? Uh, Ken Leon's finally here. <laughs> but like I said, I just wanted to address to you guys that. Uh, the Delaware channel, gaming channel, is now up, so the live streams have been moved to that channel. So if you want to stay well, tuned to any of that, please go check it out. I will not be live streaming no more on Face Rainbow, but I will be using this channel still, most of all, because this is my main channel. Um, tomorrow I might go to Grandma's, my four wheel, go on the four wheeler, and I'll post that stuff on on this channel. So stay tuned, guys, and take talk to you guys later. Peace. What's going on, you guys? I'm uh, finally across the lake. I hope that doesn't get me copyrighted. The guys are way right there. Just about like not even a minute away from me. This is a beautiful lake. Beautiful view. If you go, if you go take your canoe or boat way over there. I recommend canoe because boat you fucking break your engine. Um, there's a huge, huge, huge beaver dam over there. I don't know if it's flooding or not because we had floods here. For the past couple of weeks, I have a fire going. I'm just gonna let it burn out because I only started one. I just started uh, making ones just for fun. And uh, later on, I'm gonna make another one to cook dinner. We're gonna have hot dogs and hamburgers, an excuse for the wind. Hopefully, it doesn't affect the camera. And I got quite the wood pile here, poking sticks there. And there's lots to collect, lots of rocks to collect. So I'll see you guys when Kim Liam comes back. Okay, as you can see, I kind of got the fire going a little bit. She's kind of windy, so I got to be careful. Roasting a marshmallow. I like when it's a little bit burnt because it's nice and crispy. But I got to kind of be careful because the wind is actually coming from, you know, here. 
that direction and a little bit there and comes toward, towards the camp. So I'm actually really quite surprised I found this rock right here. It's a really nice clean flat rock and what we're going to do is probably put the hot doggies on there and maybe a burger. I also got a grill there but I'm going to wait to wash that and wait till the wood goes down a bit and then I'll put the grill on and we'll cook some hot dogs. But anyways, I'm going to wait till King Liam comes back and then we're going to tell some stories maybe. <laughs> See you guys there in a bit. We'll put our potatoes and our stuff in there. It'll be good. Yeah, as you can see, we're cooking hot dogs. They caught some fish earlier. They did? Three speckles. Are you vlogging? Watch, watch when Jim comes back. He's probably going to have fish for you. I'll just guarantee, I guarantee you he's going to have fish for you to freeze. Are you vlogging? Yeah, can Liam eat a hot dog? How is it, Liam? Give the results. This is what my hot dog looks like. Well, it's already half eaten. <laughs> And my dad spreading some ketchup on his. The boat's coming back. It looks like we have more people aboard. And there's, I think there's, there's quite a bit of people over there. I don't know how many though. 20. About 20 people. Most of them are here to visit, but there is some other camping. So. You know what I'm going to do once the fire goes out. Still, you're going to have the last one? Yeah, sure. What I'm going to do is when the fire goes out, I'm going to widen the fit pit so it can have a the pit. the pit so it can have more room to put wood and stuff in. Mm -hmm. Yeah, what's going on, you guys? We're going to take a little hike because apparently my brother found uh, one of the old fire pits I made two years ago. Say, are you going to say your intro, bud? Yeah. Yep. So, guys are coming to take a hike here. So Liam, where is the where is the pit? Oh yeah, they're putting their tents down, eh? Holy well, we fuck! Look at that firewood. Pick that up there later. It's actually pretty nice here. It's not a very big spot though, but there is quite a few places where you can put your tent. Like you can put your tent like right here. This here is a perfect spot. Fucking dirty my hands are. Just place an old table right there. <laughs> Holy shit! Some of the rocks are still there too. Fuck, that's hers. Well, I gotta tell you right now, guys, that this pit used to be a bit bigger. Like, we're about where my foot is, is how wide it was, but people have used the rocks over the couple, past couple years. And that's what it looks like. But, anyways, be careful. 2015. Yeah, so since 2015, that's where the shit bucket is. <laughs> Basic cardboard there. We're gonna go way up there to collect more sticks. Somewhere up there. Um, the guys are down there, that's the site. Some of the tents. There's quite a few places. Like right, like I said, right about over there, somewhere right around there is a perfect spot for a tent. But yeah. Anything you gotta add for tonight? Stick tuned to the live streams. Yeah, so guys, stick, stay tuned for the live streams. Because we're not staying overnight. We're not staying overnight. I would like to stay overnight, but we might be going to my grandmother's tomorrow. Uh, if we do, I'm gonna be four wheeling. Liam's gonna be on a Suzuki RM80. So stay tuned for that. Also, I'm going to be doing a tour of the fort that I have over there because I made a nice, really good fort slash hangout spot. So I'll do a video of that as well. So we'll see you guys there later on. Yeah. Yeah, we just 
Aw, oh, man. I want to go for a boat ride. Here's some of the tents. <laughs> You want to try out where they are? You need to try it there. Who knows? What's going on, you guys? Uh, yeah, she's almost night time. It's about. Let me check the time on my watch here. It is almost 8 o'clock at night. It's not, still kind of daylight out. There is the reflection of the lake on that side. It's a lot lighter on that side. The buddy is way over there with the boat. Guys, I was there as usual, and I got a nice little fire going. And, uh, you know, not much going on right now, but maybe later on when it gets pitch, pitch black, uh, I gotta go collect more firewood. I'm only going to be here probably till about 10 o'clock at night, and I'm going to be heading home, doing some live streams. Um, but before, it's going to be pitch black way before 10 o'clock, so I'm probably going to get some firewood and keep this going till probably I go home. So, yeah, so uh, my brother, Kim Liam, will be back, and we'll probably tell some camp stories. See you then. Mow towards this way, Nicholas. Oh, logs. Yeah, I, I know. <laughs> 